Welcome back. Let's turn to the latest on Urtha Punjab, the film that's made all the headlines in the last fortnight and is being released tomorrow. But it's got yet another controversy to deal with because a print of the film was leaked online on Wednesday evening. And this means that the film's pirated DVDs are also being ava are available in the market. And many are now saying, or at least some are alleging, that the censor board and its chairperson Pehlaj Nilani must explain whether the leak took place from the censor board office itself because the copy that was leaked had been submitted to the CBFC. The leak copy features some scenes which the censor board had objected to and the length of the film was also the same as the copy given to the CBFC. ये फिल्म जो हम वो ये फिल्म जो है जहाँ से भी लीक हुई है साइबर क्राइम को हमने एफआईआर किया हुआ है और वो इन्वेस्टिगेट कर रहे हैं जब तक इन्वेस्टिगेशन का रिजल्ट नहीं आएगा कोई भी हवा में नहीं कह सकता कि कहाँ से लीक हुआ है इतना बड़ा आरोप आपकी सोचें आपको लगा रहे हैं वो वो आरोप तो बहुत टाइम से लगा रहे हैं उनको लगाने दीजिए हम वेट करें जब से साइबर क्राइम साइबर क्राइम क्या रिजल्ट के साथ बाहर आ गया जो ऑनलाइन चल रही है जो फिल्म जो है ये हमारे पास जो सील की हुई कॉपी है वो आफ्टर कट जो अपना ऑर्डर जो हमें हाई कोर्ट ने दिया जो उनके करेक्शन की हुई कॉपी है वो अलग है और उसमें अलग है जो एक कट दिया था कि यूरिनल वाला जो है वो भी उसके एसिड में है जो डिस्क्लेमर है वो भी अलग है ये अलग है हाथ में हुई नहीं है तो हाउ वी विल सस्पेक्ट प्रोड्यूसर के जाके पूछिए कि क्या उसका उससे पूछिए ना आप वो ब्लेम हमारे ऊपर लगा रहे हैं क्या और आप लोगों को यहाँ तक नहीं मालूम है जो भी बंदा है जिसने लीक किया वो आइडेंटिफाई हो चुका है और पकड़ा गया let me go straight to Rakesh Upadhyay, former film censor board member and a film producer. Rakesh, who do you believe could be behind this leakage? Prima facie, do you believe this leakage has taken place through the CBFC itself? Uh, I think it can be possible from the technical team also, which is uh, uh, who are involved with the post-production of the film. Mm -hmm. Point one. Point two can be possible from the censor office also because when you send a film for the censor certificate and after you get the film uh, certified, mm -hmm. you have to submit the CD to mm -hmm. the censor board office which is mentioning in the watermark that it's a censor copy. So even I heard and I've seen a couple of pictures on the social networking site mm -hmm. where the film uh, uh, is available in the uh, some so software and the pirated uh, DVD and CDs are available in the market. It is clearly mentioned it is the censor copy. So the possibilities are bright from these two departments, either from the CBFC or either from the technical team who are handling the post-production of the film. Either way, what, either way, what does it suggest? Who deliver either way, what does it suggest that the that the film producer then is hostage to possibility of the censor board leaking it or a technician leaking it? That there is no foolproof method available. See, the problem is it can be possible whenever uh, a person uh, uh, who uh, any applicant who applied the film to the censor board. Uh, CD uh, which get delivered to the censor board office by uh, maybe sometimes you know it's an office pune or something. Mm -hmm. So it can be possible. It can be possible that even he he is involved with that. So you know it is. But yeah, possibilities are there. Possibilities are there. It can be from the CBF the CBFC maybe right. while transit while maybe it's over there. So the possibilities are bright. The possibilities of this having been leaked through the CBFC are bright, says Mr. Upadhyay. I appreciate your joining us. Clearly, there'll be more on that on the newsroom later tonight. Urta Punjab, the controversy just doesn't go away.